So, here we have a very nice example of the Browning Golden Eagle Mark III. This is the AM sideband model and um, 23 channels, I believe. And so this one um, was uh, in a collection and it's in just beautiful condition uh, overall, in my opinion anyway. There are some uh, minor issues, physical, uh, front panel wise, and the chassis, uh, ch the chassis look brand new, literally. And every tube in both units is browning tubes, original browning tubes, except for one. And so, um, yeah, it's all browning. <laughs> uh, the one thing I don't have is the original microphone. So I have this little hand microphone here, which um, it works. I don't know how well it does transmit and modulate. Um, so I'm going to include that little hand microphone with these units this uh the um the transmitter does not have the feet it, it had one foot which is right here <laughs> and so uh it doesn't have any feet i just have it kind of propped up with a couple of things underneath there so it's not to hurt the receiver but uh, so those feet will need to be replaced or or not <laughs> but these are neat vintage all tube um transmitter receiver units and uh, they're very collectible and quite nice this one seems to work well it has the spot feature here which is working you can hear that but there you go and then uh, so that's how that works and it is transmitting so let me see here i've got it in oops i'm going to put this in the modulation mode here there we go so as i key it up so i'm, I'm talking into the microphone now and as you can see uh hello so I've got this into a dummy load, and that is over here. So as you can see, looks like it's a good three watts or more. And then audio, hello. <laughs> so obviously, transmitting. <laughs> so the transmitter works. It does have one bulb out here, and that is one of these. It's a number 44 bulb. So real easy to put in. And so um, then that uh, meter will light up. But uh, this meter light is working fine, as is the uh, main display for the uh, receiver down here. And it does receive well. It receives excellent, actually. Um, and it does transmit on sideband. So uh, what you have to do is go to, let's see, we'll go to, um, uh, let's see, there we go. Oh, and then I did want to show you also, when I key this thing up, here we go. <laughs> We're on the air. <laughs> How about that? Pretty nifty. So I just love this thing. It's a lot of fun to play with. So let's go to lower sideband here. I don't know that I need to do that to transmit lower, but then we switch and watch the lights up above. So there we go. We're in lower sideband mode. Go again, upper sideband. So the lights are working there. So there's lower sideband. I did try this earlier. Let's see if it's. Yep. Hello. Yep. Working. And so, um, anyway, then you've got uh, some controls. I'm not familiar with the VFO plus or minus. I guess that's just kind of like a slider there, I suppose. Not real familiar with this. I do not have a manual. I'm just using my basic knowledge of tube rigs to, <laughs> to do a test here. But it is receiving nicely, transmitting nicely. I think it looks quite nice. Um, there's some bugaboos on the uh, side. I like it right here. There's a scratch right there. Um, the side's pretty good. The tops are nice. I think the receiver top has a couple of scratches, uh, but the sides are good. And you can look at the photos. If you see the eBay ad, you'll see, you know, detailed photos of the inside, which is absolutely looks like new to me. The Golden Eagle Mark III.